I like the library, I like use the library. that a lot, yeah. yeah. That's good. And anything else you think could be provided on the um, council side? I think it's pretty good. It's just uh, the shop's too expensive, that's why people aren't shopping there. Yeah. If they were a bit cheaper shops, people, I never shopped. But, um, in Mothman? Yeah. And down here as well as... I mean, round here, the clothes shops and stuff, I and, don't even go And into. what about on this side of... Yeah, I think the problem is there's no parking along that way, so the shops there are not going to survive, because there's nowhere to park. So every shop that opens closes like, within a year. The same on a Rimba Road and stuff, every so often a shop opens and then it closes. There's nowhere for anyone to park. So it's the parking that was... The parking, we could really... I think, stopping people coming shopping. Okay. In some places, definitely. Definitely along that way on Military Road. People aren't going to stop and shop. Hello, I'm a resident of Mossman. I believe what uh, the Mossman Council needs to think seriously about to, to brighten up this area is to provide a more cosmopolitan alfresco type dining area, open it up, give a lot more leeway and freedom to the shop owners. I mean, instead of trying to curb them and restrict the seating arrangements they have in the uh, walkways and pathways, give them more flexibility. Be like uh, what you see in France, where the cosmopolitan type dining outdoors really introduce a great atmosphere to the area. So I think there's a lot that uh, the Mossman Council can do to, to brighten up this area. I live just down the road here, so, and I've lived here probably uh, 20 years. What I'd like to see probably more down Military Road, down towards the Mossman uh, village is more, a few more open area restaurants. Uh, after, of course, after about five or six o'clock at night, there's nothing. There's only one or two restaurants there, but two, I think, two or three. Yep. That needs to be opened up a bit more to get more people in after six or seven o'clock at night there's no one around yeah other than the pub they've done the uh build a vista up so that's that's a plus uh, but yeah they probably does need a few more restaurants well if you look at the retail around the, down the military road they come and go yeah if you look at the shops how many we counted how many did you count for 13, 13 empty 13 this week shops. so really i don't know what the answer is, is to uh yep. well, i would think probably more night more Probably restaurants and yeah. cafes have probably seem to be going well. Mm. And even what is lacking here is even what they've done in Neutral Bay now, mm. the wine bars. Yeah. Apart from the overpass, the bridge, I'm, it's quite efficient, but if you want to go uh, across the road, there's no... I'm sorry, has everyone cut to the news agency? Yeah. Yep. And I think there should be definitely with trolleys, somewhere you can go straight through. Yeah, I think, um, you know, more pedestrian arcades. So really encourage, you know, more of a community environment. So something similar to the area. Correct, yeah. 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 I think, I think to make it a meeting point. Yeah. You know, more coffee shops, restaurants, um, give it better access to, uh, to people to be able to come here and you know, make, it a, make it really sort of a hard one. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, maybe one suggestion, I don't know if there are, are there any, are there any spots to park, park a bicycle to, to we, uh, we just leave our bikes. I was going to say, yeah. Yeah, I'm not necessarily secure, but we could have a designated spot there. I mean, there is the, that parking, bike yeah, parking down, there, down yeah, near yeah. the Village Green. Just more so something those. similar to that, sort of yeah. up here. Yeah. Encourage more people to use their bikes to come up their other cars. <laughs> To You've worn pink shirts today. Is that yeah. attention? It's a facade, you know, all the old, <laughs> yes. old buildings. Yes. And it's a shame that on that side of the bridge, um, it's very ugly. Oh, I just Sorry, put it down and work like it. I just don't like the way it looks. Yep. So you'd like to see that sort of area rebuilt. Re re yeah, yeah. 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 it's a facade. Can you stand We've only lived here two months, so. Oh, I think this is great though. Yeah, it's really villagey and yeah. the food's lovely. Yeah. And... I some more alfresco dining, eating. Um, like we don't have 45 options now, that's all enough. No. We don't want a Woolworths. Okay. Either Woolworths Village now or um, Paris yeah. Farm. But like I said, with a shopping trolley, it's, it's a real pain. Because yeah. I don't like parking on that side of the yeah. road. And so if I'm parked here, it's a real nuisance of a shopping trolley. So what about parking generally? Do you? I mean, I know you're obviously great bike riders, but do you find you can park relatively easily? Oh, no, not really. But if I do, I always, again, because I'm on this side of the house. Well, the one in Vista, the municipal park, car park's park. pretty good. Unless mm -hmm. I get a strip, a park on Vista Street? Yeah, yeah. I won't park in that. I'll be a car park, park. 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 
Hi, I'm a resident of Marsman, and I reckon that for this area, I'd love to see more open plan, kind of so everyone can come out, like more cafes kind of happening, and also maybe a bit more nightlife, so more restaurants, like the Fourth Village down there, so really fun to kind of go down there, get a gelato and a pizza at like night and stuff with my family, and so more things like that happening, and maybe like. Yeah, putting more markets on and more shops, maybe for like teenagers as well, because there's more like adult kind of shops. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like that. Yeah, have the shops. It's kind of hard to park. Yeah. That sometimes. Yeah, on that side of the on on the military road side, it's not really friendly to park. Yeah. But of course, we always park there close to the fitness fairs. In the yeah. car park. Yeah, in the car park. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, which is good that it's free. Yeah. But you need to know, you need to know it. So if, if you don't know it, yep. you yeah. always go over a military road. Yeah. And then you're stuck. I yeah. Think. So and then you have to look for parking spots, uh, and then, and that's a bit of a hustle. For yeah. parking on the street. Yeah. 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 Uh, and so you really have to know that, that there's a parking garage. Yeah. Yeah. And if you don't know it, then I think uh, it's not so friendly. Yeah. So do you live in Mosman? Yeah yeah yeah. 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 We do. No, in general, like it's quite good actually. Yeah, yeah. It's just the parking. I think. Yeah, it's just the parking. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. what about the range of shops? Do you find there's a <laughs> sort of a lot of shops are leaving, of course. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah well, I like, would do you say need to leave the like to do your supermarket shopping and things? Do you leave the area? Until yeah, we leave the area. Yeah, yeah. 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 We do it or in in Nutra Bay. Yeah, that's or all for yeah. the whole Mosman. Yeah. You yeah. see, IGA that's the only supermarket, and then of course Franklin's. Franklin's. Yeah. For us, it's a bit too far. Yep. And the IGA doesn't have anything. Uh, well, it's, 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 it's not true. It's limited. It's limited. Yeah. Limited yeah. range of things. Yeah. So, uh, so there's not really a choice of and and I it think, will be good and there's only there yeah. calls or a woody. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and for the rest it's not so much variety because it's all, all um, clothing shops, yep. Most, yeah. which, which yeah. doesn't really attract me, yeah. for example. Yep. <laughs> And you and you really. So that's not really local shopping, is it? Either. No. And you need to like it as well. Yeah. I think it's more. Um, it's more for uh, elderly, elderly people. Yeah. <laughs> so for young people, if you yeah. want to target us, I I, I I wouldn't shop here. Yeah. But I know from uh, from colleagues that they are um, because when we when we came living here, they said, oh, I like to shop in Mosman. It's kind of have to take an afternoon free and to go shopping there. Yeah. So yeah, some people are quite. Yeah. yeah. They want to do sort of designer label type yeah. shopping. Yeah. 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 It nearly drives me mad. Everybody trying to park their car in Hayden Street because that's where I live. Right. Which means a I don't have people for lunch. And uh, B, I don't have people for bridge. Right. Because it's parked down in Hayden Street with people who are too lazy to go underneath Franklin. Yeah. So one of the issues for you is um, the, the high demand for the on-street parking in your street. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and they can't they can't come for lunch because you can't have lunch within an hour and a half. Right. You have to have it for much longer yeah. period than that. And you can't have bridge for an hour. And so half. it's the two-hour time limit on the car yeah. parking that's the issue. Yeah. yeah. Okay.